Hey guys and gals, welcome to another tutorial for X4 Foundations. Today we're going to be covering a few different topics, but it's all about auto trading, galaxy trading, and sector trading. Be right back. All right, first thing up, if you want to do the galaxy trading, trading, sorry, and auto trading, well, you need to have your galaxy actually explored and you need to have satellites all around your stations or you need to buy uh, each individual faction's uh, basically full coverage updated satellite information, which costs about, I think it's $10 million per faction. So yeah, good luck with that. Have fun with that. So what is auto trading? Auto trading is what you do with your transport and how you actually have your transports that you own, that you have bought, and it flies around the galaxy and it automatically buys wares and sells them at other stations for you while you go off and, you know, I don't know, kill Xenon or play with things, at whatever it is you want to do while somebody else is making money for you, which is pretty cool. So how this all works, you need uh, for the auto trading part, which is which is the actual uh, thing that they advertise you to use on EgoSoft. But for that, you need, you need a captain. That captain has to be three stars. Well, look at this guy. He is absolutely three stars. Next, you need a transport you need a transport look i have a transport so we're all set we got a three star captain and a transport so we should be able to auto trade right so let's go into the m key here and i will go to property owned and i will go to my trader four which happens to be coincidentally the transport that we're looking at and i'm going to right click and i'm going to go to information and up here you might end up in the information window if you do you can just go to the behavior window you click on that behavior window you have this nice interesting thing up here dev we definitely see that i have a three-star captain so we're all set there now you come all the way down here to the, about the middle section it says it might say hold position for you or it might say something else for you who knows but this is where you need to go um, you click on that and you'll see right down here it says auto trade and it definitely tells you you need three star captain for this to work if you didn't if you, if you don't have a three star captain this will be grayed out just kind of like plunder is which needs a four uh, star captain I don't even know what that is I just noticed that okay so I'm gonna click on it and we're gonna have all this cool stuff come up so this is the important part this is what I want you to keep keep an eye on so at this point he will trade absolutely nothing because he you have told him not to trade in anything so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use this list and I'm gonna add things to it and you go just like that and just like that and what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pause here and I'm gonna get everything in here and I'll be right back all right fellows and gals I am back so this is everything I added that I want him to trade in uh, everything I don't really want him to trade in I kept out of the loop here so that's good uh, the next thing we have we have max distance to buy so this will be the max he can go so what we actually need to do is we need to kind of get him to uh, go here I'm gonna actually put this at 16 and I'll tell you well, I'll show you later why and I'm also going to put this at 16 so this means that he will travel 16 sectors from his original sector which is Argon Prime for me and he will trade in all these sectors in all these parts and all I got to do is confirm it and he's like oh wow you're awesome and I'm like yes I am and then I come over here I'm gonna right click on him and I'm gonna go oh just missed it I'm gonna go proceed with current orders and there he goes I have an auto trader I never have to do anything with him again he's good he's gonna make me money and that's it so that's how auto trader works the weird thing is and this is the weird thing there's another option and it, and it's completely baffles me why it's in here but we have another option we can do which is called galaxy trader and I'll be right back to show you that Oh, look at me. I'm on another ship. It must be another transport. Oh, look, I have another captain. Oh, but he's not a three-star captain. That's not good. We can verify that. He does not have three stars, right? And I have a transport. So I have one out of two of the options I need to make an auto trader work, which is I have a transport, but I don't have a three-star three -star captain. That's weird. How am I going to make this work? Well, here we go. We'll go back into the map screen. We will go to this particular trader, which, if I remember correctly, he should be in Argon Prime. Where is he? Blah, 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 blah. There he is. He's right there. Um, we'll get into his name if you actually caught his name in a second. Okay, so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to right-click on him again. 
No, actually, that's incorrect. <laughs> Sorry. I'm going to click on him. I'm going to make sure he's selected. I'm going to go out in my map, and I'm going to go, because I want to have him trading in engines, and engines are, if you don't know right now, in 1.32 um, are actually bugged, and they are not supplying all of our uh, shipyards and stuff so I've been making a bunch of guys that will do the engines for me and hopefully supply all these things and make me a lot of money but for right now we gotta learn about this so I am gonna go to yeah let's do Trinity Sanctum so I'm gonna right click on Trinity Sanctum there we go and you're gonna see that we have this awesome thing in here we have auto trade in uh, sector and auto trade galaxy I'm not gonna do the auto trade in sector I'm, 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 I told you I'm going to show you it, but it's basically the same thing as Auto Trade Galaxy. It works the same exact way, but they are re they. Um, if you do Auto Trade in Sector, he will not leave that sector. If you do Auto Trade in Galaxy, he will cover the whole galaxy for you, or at least what I'll show you. So I'm going to right click on that. I'll wait for you to tell me to take off. That's important. He's parked right now. Make sure he's parked when you do that order. So I'm going to go into property order again. I'm going to click on him. I'm going to information. And now look, we don't need to worry about this part down here. Also look that, hey, he's auto trading again, but he's not a three star captain. How did that happen? I don't know. We'll talk about after I teach you how to do this. All right. So all you got to do to make this work is go to auto trade. Click this and look at this. He has all the wares already selected so that's the weird thing about it auto trade three star general you have to add the wares auto trade galaxy the wares are already added but you can get rid of them so if I only want this guy to uh, work in engines I just hit these little things right here I'll probably erase the engines but I'll just re-add them so I'm just gonna kinda do this quick uh, erase all these here Oh, I actually erased that. Okay, I'm going to redo that in a second. I'll be right back. All right, I'm back. So now I have only engine parts because I only want him to sell engine parts because I'm trying to take advantage of a particular situation that's running in the game right now. So he will only do engine parts. So he's all set. This is all I have to do. If you look down here, we got the same thing as Auto Trade. He has max, dis max uh, distance to buy. He can only go 14 for some way, for some reason, and it's already maxed out because it's a galaxy trade. That must mean he only has 14 uh, gates he can go through. Uh, and the same with the max uh, distance to sell. He's going to sell everywhere he can sell. And we have an auto trader that's only skill 2, and it doesn't make much sense to me. So if anybody can figure out why this is the case, I think it's a bug, and we're not... I think... I think we're not supposed to be able to use him right now with a two star because he's supposed to be a three star. I think it's kind of a bug, so it might be fixed eventually. If it is, then you'll have to you you will have to have the three star if they actually fix it. So um, that's it, and all I have to do is the same thing. I'll go to him here. I'll right click on him, and I will go proceed with current orders, and he will take off and be done with it. Now the reason I had you guys have him park. And dock before you gave him that order because if you give him the order when he's in the space just sitting still and he has no he has no like park thing or anything like that um, he will go he will instantly start the trades and he won't be able to get rid of the ones that you don't want him to trade in so the trick to that is either have him dock or give him a move to order from like somewhere far away that'll give you enough time to actually get rid of all those uh, all those trades that you don't want him to do and that's it that's basically how you do auto trade and auto gal galaxy and auto sector by the way if you ever get stuck in here these are ladders and you can just climb up over them like that and you're all set so you know that's how it is so as always guys this is Malkuth 1974 thanks for watching thanks for subscribing and we'll see you later Malkuth out <laughs>